It has been all about getting to this stage, and two teams have made it. I'm Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary by Stuart Robson. We're just moments away from kickoff time in the UEFA Europa Conference League final. It's Barcelona taking on Real Madrid. Well, Derek, what a final this should be. Both of these sides have played some great football to get here. I just hope we see them at their best today. This should be a great game. Exciting game in prospects as Real Madrid get it underway. Well, this is what we think for Barcelona. Mark andre Ter Stegen starts in goal. Pique starts with Jordi Alba in the fullback positions. Neymar starts with Memphis out wide. And leading the line today is the hard to defend against Pierre Emerick Aubameyang. Lovely ball. Obama Yang. Can he put them in front? Off the post and back in play. Well, they've started really brightly here. They were so close to taking the lead. Well, he likes to run at them. Bale. On to Ronaldo. It comes to absolutely nothing. Well, given the form he's been in, Stuart, you would expect quite a lot of the attacking to go through Neymar. Well, it's his ability with the ball at his feet that makes him such a good player. He can go past defenders with ease, he can play in tight areas, and he has that bit of trickery as well. I'm really looking forward to seeing him play today. And Neymar! The end product just wasn't there. Marcelo. Sadio Mane now. Mane. Ronaldo. A very timely interception. Vinicius. Now Mane. That's how to blunt the edge of the opposing attack. Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. Barcelona in the quest to take the lead. Might be helped out by this corner. from Neymar goal for Barcelona they take the lead in the final are they on the way to lifting the trophy well let's look at this again it's a decent delivery into the box but just look at the space he has he doesn't even have to jump of course it's a good finish but the marking is woeful more a wake-up call for the Real players maybe can they find a response now Carvajal Mane on to Bale Cristiano Ronaldo Casemiro 
Working away patiently, looking for an opening. Well, getting close to half-time and Barcelona with the advantage. Stuart, what have you made of the performance? Yes, they've defended really well all over the pitch. Their work rate and discipline has been excellent. But any drop in tempo and this lead could easily slip away. It's Neymar! Well, there's a keeper on song. Well, how did he stop that? That's just unbelievable. It's Neymar's corner. Well off target. Didn't have an awful lot of space to work with, however. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Ronaldo. Now Mane. Splendid defending, and it needed to be. And slipped through by Karim Benzema. the drama well let's see this again the vision to play this through ball is superb and when he gets onto it he decides to go for power it's a really emphatic finish which gives the keeper no chance So underway again, following the goal that made things level. If you're wondering about stoppage time, one minute to be added on. Well, the first 45 minutes have come and gone here in Catalonia. Two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. Good movement. Now showing excellent judgment to intercept. Pedri. And Obama Young now. And return to Obama Yang. Over the byline, hence a goal kick. Mane on to Bale Marcelo a lot of forward thrust here from Ronaldo now what can he do from this excellent position oh it's in they're in front here now can they stay in front so they're playing once more will Barcelona be able to bounce back Five. and he didn't hesitate 
good thing too. Well, he's so quick off his line. That's great goalkeeping, you have to say. Well, we have 30 minutes to go. Casemiro. On to Bale. Cristiano Ronaldo. And reading it absolutely superbly. Sergio Busquets has lost it. Ronaldo. Here's Vinicius Junior. Could have been awkward for the goalkeeper. for Real Madrid. Can someone get on the end of this? Goalkeeper's ball across delivered too close to him. Twenty minutes remaining. And Real with the ball again. Azar. Cuts it back. And still looking for space. An alert intervention. Frankie de Jong. And the pie on the ball. Depay, Dion, and a chance to level it, and it nestles in the back of the net, Barca are level. It was a fairly simple finish in the end. You still have to be in the right place. Keep your composure and finish it off. And that's exactly what he did. Well, another equaliser. What a topsy-turvy game this has been. Cristiano Ronaldo. Marcelo. And still on the lookout for the goal that could be so important at this juncture. Benzema. Very comfortable when in possession. Chance to cross. Bale. He cuts it back. And it's teed up for Ronaldo. Oh, that goes down as a miscue. No two ways about it. Well, he just had to make a decent connection there, and it's a goal. No wonder he's annoyed with himself. Well, the atmosphere is so tense inside this stadium, but can they find that moment of magic to win this game? The crowd certainly thinks so. Just listen to them. David Alaba. At this late stage, Real Madrid doing everything in their power to grab a winner. Ronaldo has someone to play it to. Well, time just challenged magnificently. 
They cannot be separated here, and it's on to extra time. So away they go again, the first period of extra time, and it's legitimate to ask to what extent mental strength will come into this. Looking forward to it. Modric. Mane. Well, the pass not finding its target. Sergio Busquets. Dembele. Obama Young. To take the lead. And a goal! He's put it away. A celebratory moment. 3 2 it is. Who would have predicted that before a ball was kicked? Hazard. That's a good-looking run from Aidan Azar. Corner for Real. Can they use it productively? delivery and he clears the danger Mariano that's a very impressive piece of defending well that's it for the first period of extra time let's see what the second has in store Well, underway again, the second period of extra time. Who's going to prevail here? Obama Young. Now Busquets. Pierre Emerick Obama Young. Well, racing past his man. Alba, ready to fire. Couldn't grab hold of it. Well, he stumped it out of there without much fuss. Jordi Alba. Well, that would have been game over. But unless they show more quality going forward, there's just no way back for them. Real Madrid attacking, and they have to give it a go with time not on their side. But ultimately, up a cul-de-sac. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Well, they seem to be onto something positive, but it faded away. Mane just cutting off the supply and one minute of stoppage time has been added on well, you can absolutely sense the frustration growing in the opposition camp they can't get and there goes the final whistle the cup issue is settled A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. Memories are being made. Well, just look at those scenes down there, Derek. What a contrast in emotions. Brilliant for the winners, despair for the losers. But overall, the right team won today. Yep, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity. This is special for everybody at the club. What a great moment for any young player. And this is what you dream about when you start playing football. When you're playing in the playground, you want to win a cup. Brilliant moment.
It's a special moment in the career of any footballer. And now for the trophy lift itself. The cup winners. Well, you can just see what it means to those players and the manager. That's fantastic stuff. There's always the element of chance in a cup competition. But my goodness, they've taken the rough with the smooth. And now they savour the moment. Four marks to the entire team. And now they get the chance to exhale and enjoy. They've been brilliant in this competition, and so have the fans. They've really got behind their team. They've played a big part in this win. Just look at those faces in the crowd. Great stuff. They're really a match made in heaven between players and fans. And these celebrations are going to continue for quite some time. And now the players get to relax a bit and enjoy having the pictures taken. Well, these photos will be cherished for years to come, won't they? Certainly.